One of the biggest problems that I have and that most everyone has when they're trying to get great shredded lean abs is that they find that they're always deprived of calories, that they're always deprived of food, they're always starving, they're always craving sugar, they are always ravenous and hungry. So how do we solve this problem? And the answer to that is give you the feeling of satisfaction, that you are getting enough quality food, that you are eating all the time. There are a lot of different ways that you can eat when you're working on fat loss, but one of the most effective ways that I've seen for people is for you to be eating every two to three hours so that you feel like your stomach is always satisfied. I see a lot of people who skip breakfast and starve themselves throughout the day because they think, oh, this will be the best thing for getting abs and this will be the best thing for losing as much belly fat as I can possible. And the reality is that that's going to send you into a crash faster than anything if you are not acclimated to that kind of lifestyle. Me personally, I still get a little hypoglycemic, meaning that I can suffer from severe drops in blood sugar and I had always thought that it was great for me to be eating every two to three hours and that even I needed to eat every two to three hours or I would just crash bottom out, get tired, get frustrated, not be able to make decisions. I would have to keep my blood sugar at a certain equilibrium so that I could still function as a human being and I want you to know that by eating four to six or eight meals a day, whatever you find is a good balance for you, as long as you're hitting your calculated numbers, that your magic numbers for your lean shredded abs, then you'll be good and you can divide that uh, amount of food over as many meals in the day or meals and snacks in the day as you want, as long as you are sticking to the eating program, the fat loss food guide that we have designated for this course. So if you're worried about being starved or feeling starving or being hungry all the time on this, as long as you're eating all the right calories, you can eat pretty much as frequently as you want throughout the day and all the way up until bedtime, which is another myth that we can bust later that eating late will make you gain more fat calories in your sleep. It's not true, but we'll save that for another lecture. So I want you to eat as frequently as you need to to keep your blood sugar balanced and that'll help you balance out your hormones and help you eliminate cravings as well so that you aren't bottoming out that blood sugar and craving sugary things that'll jack it back up again and cause you to gain abdominal fat and, and that'll just keep yourself away from the abs that you want. That will be self-sabotaging toward your own progress. So eat four to six to eight meals a day, whatever works best for your schedule. Uh, the only downside to a high frequency eating schedule that I've seen with myself for my own clients and students is that it can get a little convenient at times if you don't have a kitchen or cold storage like a refrigerator or a freezer at work or your office, then I've seen a lot of people struggle with being able to keep a high frequency eating schedule and to keep their blood sugar balanced. And if that's the case, in my next lecture, I'll cover some other eating strategies that you can employ to get around that and how you can actually eat massive meals, massive satisfying meals that will help optimize your abdominal fat loss so that you can continue to get lean abs.